Hi everyone, this is Peter. Today I want to introduce is the PXW X70. So if you're looking for something, a uh, camcorder which is uh, affordable price, small size, a lot of professional functions, this is something which I strongly recommend. Why is first, okay, for the picture wise, it's have a lot of improvement because it's, it's built in a one inch XMOS sensor. So a lot of people will know, we, we, have a, we have a concept about okay such kind of small camcorder and then they normally the size of the of the of the uh, sensor is maybe is smaller like they were maybe a, a one third or even smaller so that means no matter the um, the um, um, the noise compressions the depth of field the the color performance and then it's actually pretty shit but because of the one inch sensor so the noise compressions or the picture qualities is actually superb. Is you never ever think about like maybe for a small size of camcorder you can have such kind of like good qualities of pictures, and um, another function is this is a 4K ready camcorder. So that means okay for maybe a future proof you maybe uh, is still at this moment we don't know maybe you have to pay maybe for extras to get a 4K upgrade or maybe there is external recorder or something else. But at least this is a 4K ready sensor. So it's a life cycle for your, maybe for this camcorder is much longer because maybe it's, it's, we are now in the transition in between the HD to a 4K. So now this camcorder can be actually go to one stage to another stage already. And uh, for the operation wise, and then this is something which really impressed me is it come with a 3G SDI BNC output and also HDMI because if you are looking for a, um, a BNC 3G SDI output uh, connector, and then normally you you have to talking about like maybe a more high end camcorder, and then you never ever think about like for uh, for such a price of this camcorder, and then they come with these connectors, and then this is really impressed me. And then the other thing is they also put on uh, a three dimensional uh, um, controller controller button which is actually more easy to operate, especially like maybe when you're doing a handheld, you're pressing the, uh, the menu buttons and then you're using one hand to, to uh, control all the functions, including like enters, like maybe a go up, go down. And then this is good because maybe you no need to go to maybe a menu, you go to part, maybe press some buttons and then to set something up, which is a lot of hassle. But now one button can do everything. And um, other than that, the recording media is still very user friendly. It's using um, the SD card, and then you got two slot. One slot you can choose SD card or the uh, Memory Stick Pro, and then um, this is something good because you got two slot. So that means you can have like maybe uh, A jump to B functions, and also you can have a simultaneous recording. That means if sometimes touch wood you have some issues with one of your SD card. You still have another copy, which is I think is pretty important. I would strongly recommend to put two cards all the time, and then maybe to record simultaneously if you are maybe doing something which some shoots which is really important for you. And uh, for and also the code that itself is the XAVC Long God. You will think about okay, oh XAVC Long God. The XAVC intro is better. Yes, true, but for the for the camcorder price and also maybe uh, I think XAVC Long God is already giving you a, such a privilege about like maybe a better no, a better compression because we all know that the XAVC Long God is a 422 50 megabit per second which is actually similar to the um, to the uh, 422 HD uh, MPEG 2 50 megabit per second which is offering on the uh, PMW 200 which you might have to use the SYS card. But now you're using SD card, it's already do that. So that means the, um, the XAVC codec is already break through this. And then you got a very good picture through the one inch sensor. You got like a less compressions uh, uh, codec, which is the XAVC along got. I think for, for this camcorder, for the picture wise, this is already a breakthrough, especially for this kind of price too. And uh, other than that, you also got like the three steps of ND. So you got um, the, this ND is not an electronic ND, it's actually an actual filter ND. So it's, um, it's more user friendly for you for a lot of like maybe run and get situations, outdoor situations, and then, and then other than that, okay, 
a small camcorder, you might need to even maybe smaller because sometimes you might no need to have like the XLR uh, connections. So what you need to do is just take this out and then you've got an even smaller camcorder. And uh, you see the uh, the connector itself, the XLR connector, you don't have any cables and then it's have like a connectors, the electronic contact point in between the hot, the, the cool shoe. What you need to do is just like maybe put it on and then it's already like connected together and then without any cables. It's more um, user friendly and not easy to get like maybe broken, especially you know, talk about like the cables always get broken. And then other than that, the only Downside for me is the lens cap because now they are not like a button which is maybe an open and flip functions and then you always have to maybe open it and then maybe close it with a lens cap which is something which I think a lot of people will easy to get lost and then maybe uh, that is the only downside for me. But for the camcorder itself, no matter the uh, the function that they provide, the price and also the uh, um, the, the qualities of the pictures, I strongly recommend this. And um, if you want to know more about like this PXW X70, please visit ANS website.